everyone, Jacqueline here, and I am so excited to be announcing our week four theme in just a few minutes. I cannot even believe that we have already made three games and we're going on to our fourth game. This has been a crazy ride. I've already learned a ton about time management and the importance of planning before you start working on a project. I have even started organizing my stuff into tasks on Trello, which you can check out. I'm going to link that below. You can check out my postmortem video for last week, which talks about all of the things that I learned over the last week and things I'm going to take with me moving forward into this journey. If you're just joining us this week, you can check out my previous videos on the games that I've made over the last three weeks. But besides that, I think we're gonna get started. Let's do it. All for one. So this immediately reminds me of pirates because of the saying like all for one, one for all kind of thing. Um, I guess what that really reminds me of is not pirates, but like that SpongeBob episode where they're fighting with Mr. Krabs over the Flying Dutchman's treasure that they found based off of a board game. All for one. And one for all. If that's not inspiration, I don't know what is. Um, besides that, I guess uh, you could do a multiplayer arena game where maybe you have to collect things, just kind of like do like a really mini game. Um, very like uh, Mario Party-esque where you fight against the other couple of players and maybe you're collecting things um, and you want to be the one to have the most. So you could use this as like maybe like a mechanic. So maybe um, having more than the other players gives you like a bonus or different, um, different boosts, I guess. Like powers or bonuses um so i guess what i'm thinking here is maybe like if you have all the items like you can run faster or um if you have all the items or something you can maybe like use power like shoot lasers out of your eyes yeah so i definitely think this is going to be a fun one i'm already having a ton of ideas so i can't wait to start brainstorming this I will also be doing a brainstorming video shortly after that where you can see my process in brainstorming and um, just see what I came up with this week. If you like this video, like and subscribe, join our Discord because we definitely want to talk to you about the games that you're making, and if you love these videos and would like to see more, support me on Patreon. I am planning a whole slew of upcoming videos on game design topics, tutorials for Unity, and more. So I would love your support in that and I can't wait to see you guys in the next video.